Hello everyone, it's me again, GW Fans Topcore Brony, welcoming you back to Let's Play Super Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars. Ha <laughs> ha, he can't get me. Anyway, this door's been open a while, and, well, no one's come out, so it must be safe. Oh. Arr. Arg. Oh. Oh, really? Why? Oh, yeah, we heard about Johnny. Do you... Well, yeah, never mind, you do, never mind. Yeah, well, I'm not listening, because just like everything else around here, you guys are weak to lightning, so... Bye bye Yeah, that was easy. Thanks, Mallow! <laughs> All right. Yeah, just let him go. Don't do anything. Now, before we get this treasure chest, let's keep on going for a little bit. And oh, oh. Wouldn't that be a good thing? I mean, you don't care if he's as if he's uh well gone, right? Uh oh. Uh oh. The old Donkey Kong trick. Good thing Mario's had experience with that. How dare you dodge the barrel! Yeah, well... I ran. Duh. Oh, has it. <laughs> Ain't that cute. Thinking that one more guy is gonna make a difference or something. Well, sorry. Quanti uh, quality over quantity, guys. <laughs> all right. Oh, all right. Sweet. Forgot about that. All right. Got a level 13. All right. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, what am I in? An HP level? Yep. All right. HP. Nice. 110. Very good for Mario. All right. Sorry, Mallow. No HP for you, but you'll be fine. No, good step boost there. Lots of HP for you. Bowza. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, since nothing else is really that worthwhile, so... I mean, like I said, I could, but nah, I think I'll stick with the HP for now. Actually, even if you don't ever take HP bonuses, he his HP should still be higher than everyone else's, assuming uh, they don't like, do a whole ton, like, of extra HP bonuses. So, oh, right! And Toes will come back at level 13. Basically, it's a pick-me-up. So, anyway, HP for you. Oh, her HP is already at 90. She's already a little behind Mario now. What, uh, by 20 points? All right. Okay, cool. Well, now we can get this treasure chest, which is, uh, full health, which I, well, I got all my health back, but at least I got some FP, too. So, uh, now I'm going to, uh, change my party up a bit, and I'll be right back. Alrighty, I've switched up my party. I've specifically put Gino and, er, well, Bowser in my last position for a particular reason, but anyway, we are equipped Mario with the safety ring, which he sort of needs, sort of doesn't. Uh, Gino's got the amulet, and Bowser with the zoom shoes, even though... Eh, Bowser could probably use the amulet as well, but I think we're gonna do we're doing well fine there, so. 25, 30, 30. Oh, right, you're still gonna be Oh well, it doesn't matter. Yeah, they have the same speed, so that means that Bowser's actually gonna go first, but anyway. Arr, a big shark pirate thing! I've been searching all my life for Oh, wait a minute, I'm the that's the wrong guy there. <laughs> Mamma mia! <laughs> oh yeah, fell into the sea, so it's, uh... Anyway, Jonathan Jones, everyone! And he wants to fight. And, uh, ow! I... That's a little stronger than... Ooh, ouch. Yeah, these guys are pretty fast. I think they have a speed of, like, 32 or something, but... Anyway, uh, I'm actually going to... 
let's see, save state right here, because I'm going to show you both ways to uh, fight Johnny. Starting with the, well, probably the easier way, really. So, uh, let's start with uh, Terrorize, because, well, Johnny and his cronies are all affected by fear. As long as it doesn't miss. Sweet! Alright, half damage now, great. Gina boost to Mario, like always. Now, uh... Yeah, the blue bandanas there, they are weak to lightning, so Mallow could probably one-shot them all, but, uh... Johnny is not weak to lightning, or anything, for that matter, other than, I guess, fear, anyway, but, uh... I want to start eliminating some of these guys. You know what? It actually would have been more beneficial for Gino to be ahead of Bowser, because then he could have given Bowser a boost right now before Bowser gets a turn, because I'm not going to be able to take out one of these guys with Bowser, I don't think. Or not. Never mind. <laughs> Good timing. Sweet. Actually, I should, uh... Not save state there. I'll save state after they all attack here. Because this is where things get a little different. Ah! Let's see, Gino needs to still boost himself, right? So, uh, anyway, I do not want to take out this guy. I want to attack Johnny instead. Boom. Oh, wow. Yeah, you do still need to boost yourself, right? Alright, so... Now after... well, probably after Bowser hits him. He's going to use another move. I'm surprised he hasn't used any of his magic attacks yet. He has two magic attacks, Diamond Saw and Mega Drain. Uh, the safety ring will protect Mario from Mega Drain. Now when he does uh, get tough, he does so after, I think, like, some certain amount of HP. Uh, normally he would... well, you'll see later, but... Right now, since there's still this guy here, this battle is not going to change in any way. Wow, that was kind of weak. Also, he's his fear is, like, kind of nullified, and even though I can still, like, get fear on him, it doesn't seem to affect his defense. So, I don't know about that. What's up with that? Dude! Oh. Oops. Anyway. Yeesh. Should have him, like... Oh, yeah, right now. Oh, there we go. And that's, uh, Johnny. At least, that's the easier way to fight him anyway. Oh, lucky. Well, this is, since I'm not going to save this anyway, why not... Uh... Oh. Well, that sucks. Not that I... Actually, no, it doesn't. I already have full money, but... Anyway, let's do it the other way, then, shall we? So... With our other method, I want to take out Bandana Blue here. Hmm, not so great timing, but anyway. Alright, and start getting them. Obviously, Super Jump would be better, but... Would you please, like, use a magic attack this time? I mean, come on, dude. I'm gonna have you, like, after Gino attacks you here. Alright, get tough. And he should... Okay, back there, one more hit, probably. <laughs> Why do you, like, not have your pirate accent anymore? Or... Huh. Yeah, see, he doesn't really sound like a pirate much like this, does he? Or is there just no way to convert that? I don't know. Good fun. Yeah! What's up with that? You don't not have your accent anymore. Alright, anyway, we gotta fight Johnny one-on-one! -on -one. And here's his backup. It's kind of funny how Bowser is not really, uh... I mean, he's kind of celebrating, but he's like... What are they bowing for? Well, anyway, this is a one-on-one -on -one fight. As you can see, Johnny, well... He's not really that hard, especially when he doesn't do anything, so... He does have some magic attacks! 
Thank you, Mega Drain. Diamond Saw. This is gonna hurt. A little bit. But... Yeah, fortunately, I've got uh, Geno Boost still, so... Mega Drain Safety Ring would have protected me from, but he never used that, so... Or protect, yeah, protect Mario from anyway, but uh, yeah, he's still not that tough, especially when you have Jump behind you, so... That's still the same amount of experience and money, right? So only he's worth that, not his cronies? Uh, no. no. Well, not that it really mattered. Ah, okay. Souvenir, huh? Well, you gave that up. Well, not that easily, but anyway. Do, 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 do. Now, the reason I have Bowser standing right there is just so you can see something a little bit better regarding him. That's kind of unique. Yeah, he's not really happy that we got the star, interestingly. He's not going to do anything about it, but he's kind of, you know, still has his uh, second thoughts about, you know, saving the world instead of, well, not really conquering it, but, you know, no one being able to rescue Toadstool and all that, so. Anyway, fully healed, and... Yeah, we did! Get out of here! Hey, wait, did you... Did you lose your accent again? Uh, I don't know, maybe that was just something that you could really do there. <laughs> it's like Chrono Trigger! He's the man! And his name's even Johnny! <laughs> I never noticed that before. How funny. And then we got a trampoline that'll take us outside. Alright! So, yeah, we're done with the second ship with our, like, 999 frickin' coins. <laughs> like, it's so used right now, but... Or buy something with. I mean, jeez. Anyway, back to Seaside Town. Oh! Hey! Uh, you waited for us. Hee hee hee. Yeah, yep, yeah, we did. You're the, uh, old guy. Yuridovich, at least I think that's how you pronounce it. Oh, well, that sucks. Kinda, not really, kinda, but. No, no, not, not really. Oh. Why does he care, anyway? <laughs> I mean, are, are, are wishes really that, like, I don't know, pertinent in this world, or whatever the word I'm trying to use is. Ah. Uh, if you say... Well, actually, let's show you. Why not? If you say, get serious. Ah. Oh. Yeah, he'll go have this guy torture the real elder. Well, sort of. I think he's, like, tickling him or something. You'll see if you keep on doing that, but... Oh, never mind. Yeah, he's getting tickled. But, uh, anyway, let's not do that. Let's just hand it over nice and easy right away. Eee! <laughs> yeah. Such a genius. Ah. Uh, thanks, Trixie. Anyway... Oh. Oh, that's right. They are kind of inhabiting Bowser's Keep, aren't they? You're right. Dang it! Well, crud. Anyway, no one at all is around. Uh, we can't uh, open the... Well, the shed here to get the people out. But, uh... We're gonna have to get that star back, obviously. So, I'm going to change my uh, party again real quick. And I'll be right back. Alrighty, now normally this next fight would be actually dangerous enough to require Princess Toadstool, but that's why I picked up elixirs before, because I want to use another. Mallow, who is uh, once again going to shine, because he's actually, well, very effective. Probably the most effective he's ever going to be against a boss, <laughs> to be perfectly honest. So, uh, anyway, I got him with the amulet and the work pants to uh, increase his damage uh, tenfold there. Mario with the safety ring, kind of for precaution, I guess. And Gina with the zoom shoes, kind of just because, really. So, 
Yeah, even though he Malice got the work pants, his magic defense is still great thanks to the amulet there. Oh, Gino's actually not. You know, actually, he'd probably be better off with the. Uh... No, you'd be. Oh no 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 no! Actually, that would work fine. Never mind. Yeah, I think I would rather prefer that because their speed will still. Uh... Yeah, he'll still be faster. So. 40, 30, sweet. Okay, good, good, good. Yeah, I think I'd rather have that since he has lower mana defense. Not that there's uh, much that we can block in this next fight, but there is one move. Blades late. Now, I kind of spoil the fight, but whatever. What was, how else was I going to re-equip? <laughs> it's taking him so long. Oh, yeah. Oop. Sorry about that, I... Got interrupted for a second there. Anyway. <clears throat> ah, yes! Rust? What? Oh, hello! Double trouble. Oh, you sure like us a lot now. Ah. Oh. You don't have a plank. Can you make him walk the rocks instead? Thanks, guys. Ah. Uh, our disguise, he says. But he's actually one guy. Well, sort of, I guess. But anyway. And then we have the real Yuridovich, who is, well, a spear. And, unlike normal, I'm actually going to boost Mallow first, partly because he has lowest HP, and, uh, partly because he's going to be doing the brunt of the damage in this fight, big time. Now, being a spear, you'd think he'd actually be, like, strong against jumps or something, but he's not, so... And he's always, always going to start off with the almighty Water Blast, which Safety Ring does not protect us from, unfortunately. Ow! Yeah, that's what I wanted the elixirs for, but, uh, we have Shocker, one of the most powerful moves Mellow can do, and also one of the hardest moves to time perfectly. It's not that hard to time normally, it's just that if you... Well, you kind of got to do it, like, sort of like... Oh, boy, I don't even know how to explain it, so hopefully I can do it right. If I do, I've already tried this out. If I do, I'll get 315, so... Now... Right? It's kind of like in the middle of that sound effect there. I timed it wrong. But it's like, not, you can't do it too soon or too late. But, oh, and actually, yeah, I do want you to Geno boost, because Metal is still faster than this guy. Yeah, if I do it perfectly, I'll get 315, which is huge in this fight. Yeah, Mallow can do more damage than anyone else at this particular point in the game, barring the super jump, so... Alright. Oh man, again? Jerk. Ow. He has another move called Flamestone, which will, uh. Well, which the safety ring can block, so. Ah! Dang it. Oh well. Still doing tons of damage there, but. Kind of, but I, I just, I tried to figure out ex the. Oop, uh, no, 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 no! I don't want Gino to like get killed off there. But uh, yeah, I tried to figure the exact timing for it out. But thanks for hitting someone other than Gino. Not that it does that much damage to Mallow, but uh, yeah, it's it's really hard to time. So no, I think I did it too early. Yeah. Oh well. Anyway. This guy's not too tough, I think. He doesn't have that much HP, so... Well, I mean, sorta. He has more HP than any other boss he faced thus far, but... And then he may do this along the course of the battle. Mirage attack. One of them is real, one of them is fake. Uh, the fake one will take more damage than the real one, so one way you could determine it is by just using Thunderbolt, or you could just single target, because the first one you target is the real one. So, yeah. 
Ah, I never timed it right. Darn it. Because he's, like, right about to die here, too. Yeah, he's dead. Anyway. Darn it, never timed it right. Oh, well. Yeah, that's probably the hardest move in the game to time, to be perfectly honest. And you know what? I thought of maybe doing 100 super jumps, but yeah, that one's really hard to time perfectly. Ah. You gotta do it, like, before the strike, and it's, like, right in the middle of that sound effect. That, I don't know. Anyway. Alright, music's back. Everything's good. And Johnny's gone. Even though there's only two left. <laughs> Yeah, he got into the race a little late, but, well, he's there. Anyway, got the shed key and the note. Oh, yeah, old. <laughs> I'm snickering because they can think of another word that rhymes with Yorida bitch. <laughs> Sure, I'll do that. Why not? Jonathan Johnny Jones. All right, yeah, I'll drop in on you again. Why not? There's, well, something totally pointless we can do there, but uh, anyway, let's get everyone out. Uh, you're welcome. I love this place because there's like a whole different, like a whole bunch of people from various towns we've been to so far. Yeah, this guy's from uh, Rose Town and, you know, Moleville. You're welcome, and I don't know, maybe Mushroom Kingdom, maybe around here, I don't know. Maybe Marymore, who knows. Step on by, and I don't know why the kids are on the shop there, but... Oh, you're welcome. Stop by the inn, okay. See you there. And the real elder. And if you didn't let them torture him at all... Yep, gave it the star to save us. Please take this with our thanks. He'll give you a flower box, and I think depending on how many times he got tortured, he'll give you a lesser and lesser reward until he gives you nothing, but... Anyway, we got a flower box, so... 90 freaking flowers. Good grief. Uh... Let's see... There's a whole bunch of stuff we can do in town here now, especially in particular with these uh, mushrooms that I want to get rid of finally, so I'm going to do that first, and then we're going to explore the rest of the town later, but there is something else I want to do afterwards, but... Oh, no, not not you. Now, anyway, the thing with the, I want, the reason I wanted the mushroom is because of the Mushroom Boys shop here. Bring him... Oh, any just plain mushroom, and he will uh, tell you about the hidden ones... Uh, uh, among the regular ones. Or the special ones among the regular ones. So, he has to taste them to find out, and we just had to give him, you know, our mushrooms we have in our inventory. So, okay, here you go. All right, out, much, much, much. And most of the time, it's just going to be a regular mushroom. It's totally random. But sometimes, uh, you'll get other things out of it. Like, he'll get, like, mushrooms that will, uh, he'll give you better mushrooms. And he'll give you, like, max mushrooms, royal syrups. Uh, on rare occasions, you could even get ones that will give you, where he'll give you a uh, rock candy. It's the only way to farm rock candies, as far as I'm aware. And he's not giving me anything. But other times, you can also get uh, flower mushrooms, and he'll give you a flower tab for those. So you can, well, if you want, max out your mushrooms right now, or mushrooms, max out, max out your flowers right now. Would you give me at least something, dude? Come on. It's not far out. Give me something, man. How many do I have left? Am I out? Did I save all these for nothing? I want to get at least something out of it. You're going to screw with me, aren't you? It's my last mushroom, dude. Well, anyway, this is actually a really good way to, uh, well, get the flowers if you want them, or stock up on rock candies, not that it's a very quick way to doing it, because right next door at the health food store, we can just buy mushrooms for four coins, so... 
Dude. Give me at least one item out of all that. Come on. Oh, thank you. Berry mushroom. You'll give us a maple syrup, which is not terribly... Well, maybe you won't give us a royal syrup ever. Maybe it's just the maples. But anyway, you can just keep on doing that over and over and over again until you max out your flowers or whatever if you want to. I'm not going to do that. But anyway, I've finally gotten rid of my mushrooms that were worthless! But uh, anyway, before we explore the rest of town, which I'll actually do next time, uh, I want to take up Johnny on his offer there. Oh, and also do one other thing, now that I think about it. I almost forgot, uh, before I didn't actually talk to, uh, well, see why it is that no one suspects Toadstool's gone. Which I might as well do now, because there's, uh, something else we can do here now as well, but... She is? But she's in our party! Oh, hello! Oh. Fortunately, Toadstool's grandmother, or whatever she is, is a shapeshifter just like Mario! Ah, help destroy Smithy. Hint, hint. <laughs> Alrighty. You here? Alrighty. So, yeah. I guess. Had to do it. But anyway, the real reason I'm here is because during a very short window of time, like right after you get the fifth star, and I think before you go to the next area, the guest room is being occupied. Hey! Samus! Who's resting up from Mother Brain in her suit for some reason, and she has a really big sprite, because you can actually... I was doing it before. Yeah, you can actually stand on her behind the bed. So, yeah, her sprite's freaking huge there. But, uh, yeah, that's all she says. She's just resting up her mother brain in her suit for some reason. But, uh, yeah, a very small window of time you can do that there. So, anyway, I'm going to actually, like I said, take up Johnny on his offer and, well, go back through the entire sunken ship real quick. Well, sort of real quick, and I'll, uh, meet you in where we fought Johnny. Annoyingly, you had to put in the password again, but, uh, this is what happens when you come through here, just so you know, you just kinda go through, but... Anyway... Oh. Well, I, uh... I didn't know this came back. More money that I totally didn't need. Well, anyway, there's some more money you can get that you can save for later, I guess. Alright, now that we're back here. Oh, still the main man. <laughs> you already beaten that smithy cre No, I haven't. There's not really much we can do here, but... Oh, this is something I actually forgot about. 100% current juice. It's mighty tasty stuff. Okay, uh... I'm guessing that's supposed to be some kind of alcohol or something in the original AV, but... Other thing that we can do that's kind of odd. You remember he was standing here in front of this pipe before. If we look into the pipe, uh, we can look at various places in the ship for no good reason. I guess maybe he was watching us show up. I mean, everything after the, uh, squid there anyway. I mean, it's pointless. I don't know why we had to come all the way back here to do that or what the point of doing it is other than maybe showing that Oh, look, there's the safety ring. Oh, well, there's one thing you could do, I guess. What do you know? I didn't realize it pointed that out, but yeah, it, besides showing off that, uh, well, Johnny might have actually been spying on you, but anyway, I'll be uh, exploring the rest of, uh, what is it, Seaside Town next time on Let's Play Super Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars. Arrivederci! Uh, <laughs> well, anyway. <laughs>